Neptune's storms hit hard. But the search for truly extreme weather takes us out of the solar system altogether, into uncharted territory. Out here, there are storms that make even Neptune's winds look like a breeze. Katrina was just a sneeze compared to the winds we have on Osiris. The search for megastorms leads to alien worlds whose violence defies imagination. Space is full of stars and planets where violence and chaos reign. Astronomers scour the skies for new worlds, and the king of the planet hunters is Professor Jeff Marcy. He scans the night sky, seeking new worlds around distant stars. Marcy's team has instruments so sensitive they can even predict the weather on these distant planets. This is Osiris, 150 light years from Earth, a planet from hell with matching weather. Earth is 93 million miles from the sun. It orbits the sun in one year. But Osiris is just four million miles from its star. Its year races by in just three and a half days. When Osiris passes between us and its star, starlight briefly shines through its atmosphere, giving us a glimpse of conditions on the alien world. And they waited until the planet was in front of the star. At that moment, some of the starlight passed through the atmosphere of the planet, they were able to do essentially a chemical assay, a chemical assessment of the composition of this atmosphere. Osiris gets blasted by the intense heat of its star. Temperatures top 2,000 degrees. Now, what that means is that the uh, environment on that planet is, well, hideous for life as we know it. But even more, the intense heat causes the gases to expand and they have no place to go but the backside of the planet. Osiris is tidally locked. The same side of the planet always faces the star. The other looks out into space. The temperature difference is immense. Superheated atmosphere roars from the bright side of the planet to the dark at nearly six times the speed of sound. In fact, the winds will be something like two or three thousand miles per hour. Enormous speeds of these winds, uh, ten times, twenty times faster wind speeds than the strongest hurricanes. Katrina was just a sneeze compared to the winds we have on Osiris. Osiris is a brutal world. Too hot and too violent for any kind of life we could imagine. But there are even larger megastorms, storms on the scale of whole galaxies. These vast 